Hello, and welcome. I'm Zinder, and uh, you remember what I said about coming up here near the boiler anomaly? Well, I, I came up here, I walked a bit of a circle around it. Really foggy. Uh, and there's these guys here. These guys are gonna talk to um, pretty sure this is not going to end as they expect. Stalker, помоги! <sighs> Stalker, quick, come help Petruha. Look over there at the edge of the crevice. He got whacked by an anomaly. His closed respiratory system must have decompressed again and he must have fainted from toxic and heated fumes. This fucking SSP is only causing trouble for us and we've been saving for months to buy one. I tried to help him but my SIVA is almost completely destroyed from dog bites and now I'm so badly burned that I feel I'm done for if I take another step. Help us, please. <sighs> this is only going to end in sadness. Yeah. I can't do this without one of those fancy suits. Huh. Hmm. Yeah, so the real problem now seems to be that I need a suit. I mean, there's a couple of these crash shites. Crash sites I could go after. Not this one. This one's pretty much impossible to me right now. Uh, this one takes some... Well, not... Well, yeah, I'd have to say probably effort to get to. Uh, oh, those are the only two in this zone. And then there's the unreachable stash, which is a terrifying concept. I can go to the other area. Not this one. This is Pripyat. But I can go to here, technically, but, like, even these aren't even much better. So, it's one of the problems I seem to encounter sometimes with the Misery mod is, what do I do? And I guess the answer is, find something to shoot at? I don't even know. Because I haven't got much in the way of money. Uh, I guess I could walk the whole way down to there and we can attempt to deal with uh, things. Um, snorks! Wow. Okay, so apparently for some unknown reason, lately, when I go to play Stalker, my brain shuts down. Not sure how I feel about this. Yeah. Uh. What? Ahead of me? Sounds like it's approximately this way. I mean, there was gunfire. It has since stopped. Um. You're slightly in the air, good sir. As he casually walks back to the ground. Oh, jeez. Ow. Um. Well, crap. That's not how things were supposed to transpire at the beginning of this. No. Oh. Right. Still the whole way up here. I should probably quick save farther down. Um, I, I don't really want to go that way, thank you. Uh, yeah, heading towards land and staying on as much of the actual land as possible seems like a decent idea. But one of the... Yeah, that, that seems to be one of the real big problems that I'm having right now. Because... This mask isn't going to do anything for me. It's got decent toxicity, toxicity resist, but there's like zero thermal slash acid resist. So that's not going to help me 
at all. This is pretty wrecked and it's pretty useless to begin with. So, I'd rather not discuss that. I mean, there's a chance this mask might let me do one of the crash sites, but somehow I doubt it. The real question is, how many other completely ridiculous random encounters am I going to come across? So I'm in this weird situation where I can't really hunt for artifacts because I don't even have a detector, let alone a good one. I have an artifact container, but that's only so useful. And, you know, obviously I start with the artifact handling tool, but outside of that, I'm not 100% sure what I should really do. Uh, these are yeah, these are side protection tablets. So maybe between this and this, I might be able to get over there. Maybe. I'm curious now. Well, I also kind of go after that just to get it. <sighs> decisions, decisions. I know I can get a specific artifact, but I'm not sure how good of an idea it really is, technically. That said, I have access to night vision with this on, psi resistance, and I probably don't want to get it broken because I won't be able to afford to repair it closest thing I have to a decent income right now is animal parts. And even that's kind of... Mm. Oh, my UPD's actually down a power notch. That's ridiculous. See, that's another anomaly, which is probably best if I don't get too terribly close to. As I say that, I walk into a hole that I can't walk out of without going... Mistakes were made. And where did I save? This, this is a question. Ah, okay. There's another thing, I have such a quick save obsession that I forget where I quick save. I quick save a lot, actually, if you haven't noticed. So I need to get down there. And that is not going to get me there. Yeah. Yeah, about that. But I have to figure out a way to get down there. I mean, there's some rocks and stuff that are jutting out, but. Seems like a terrible plan. Like, I could probably make the fall from there to there without dying, but how much damage do I take in the process? Okay, I lied. But I did see another ledge. I... This is still an awful idea. Like, everything about this is an awful idea. Yeah. Oh god. Um. 
Have I mentioned how awful of an idea this is? It's getting dark. Oh god. Okay, I'm not dead yet. Oh, it turns off my night vision to do that? Probably because the passage of time would drain my battery, and it's probably not set up for that, really. I can only assume. I don't know. Everything seems to be fine. Mostly. And yes. Okay. Received item steel box. I'm aware I did not save before coming down here. That was for a very good reason. I mentioned that this is a horrible place. Future reference, one is not enough. Put two shots into them. The moment you see them. Also, you can't stealth past a snark in its own territory. That should also be duly noted. Speaking of snarks. So, I should probably, uh, oh, oh, it auto-saved. Really, pressing, okay, cool. I, I accept this, um, prospect then. I don't even care that I overused. Shotgun shells. Don't even care. Speaking. Of, yeah, okay. I have slugs and I have buckshot. snorks. Uh, mostly why I hate shotguns and night vision. But, you, know. you know. what? Let's stick with the green night vision. It probably won't help me, but let's stick with it. It is a bad when it comes to shotguns. I seem to have better aim firing from the hip than I do using the sight. You know what? I don't care. I will fire all the shots at shells until they stop coming at me. What's worth more, my life or bullets? Answer? Bullets. Yeah. They really are. Ridiculous. 
It's costing me so much in the way of medical supplies. Where, oh where, is the inevitable more snorks at? I'm pretty sure you encounter a lot more than three trying to get out of here. Which... What? Where am I? This place is a damn maze. Like, it really is. I'm... Can't see enemies through giant smoke clouds. Why do gun generate smoke cloud? Is gun not fog machine? I see the light. said I don't oh god oh god how do we even feel about this encounter Whew. I can tell you right now I've probably made more from this stupid snort pieces and I'm getting out of this mission as a reward. Uh. Oh good. Cats. I'm, I'm going to accept this. I have quick save. Granted, I believe that auto save would stay there. What are you going to do, right? They just leave, because that would be preferable. There's a dead dog there. Must have been the gunfire I heard while I was inside. I'm going this way. This way should be roughly the right way. Yeah, I think I see the edge of the, uh... There it is. The very edge of the boat. And I can't really sprint because I'm currently slowly losing stamina while walking. Because I am... Oh, grotesquely overweight. Why? Exactly? Oh. Box weighs 13 and a half kilograms. Right. Okay. <sighs> this is. This is unfortunate. That's all I have to say. This rain. This rain is quite loud. To me, any. But you don't know how it is for you. It may also be loud. But if I turn down the rain, then everything else will probably be too quiet, too. Even though most of the speaking is in Russian. And the gunshots are. gunshots. We are bark, bark, I say. With things. How they haul? I don't trust this guy in the slightest. What's 
you got in it? Uh, let's see here. Set up Kevlar plates. least two folded sheets of military maps presenting some parts of the zone in an in-depth way. He gave me his pistol, but he gave me Kevlar body plates. There's two different suits, that one's 88,000, that's... One of these was better than the other, and I can't remember. Oh yeah, it was the green one. Right? As far as I can tell? Yeah. This doesn't even have armor on it. That's hilarious. Uh, okay, so you can have these, 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 these. So, how much is this even worth? Not bad, not bad. I think I'll keep it, though. I think I'll keep it. That went fairly well. The truth is top, just. Expecting to find looking in here, to be honest. Here's this helmet, which costs 34,000. Side protection of 62. So 62 is not bad. Yeah, so side block is about as good as an actual full respiratory set. Plus, this provides. I have no idea how much, because base it says negligible. And I can tell you it's definitely not enough to go explore that place. Uh. Hmm. Buy that. It was a little bit profitable, like, minorly profitable. Like, exceptionally minorly profitable. So, yeah. I'm curious. Hmm? Yeah, I did, just like all the other dead bodies. No. Okay. Yeah. So, question, 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 question. How much do these cost? E. I'm actually down money if I buy those. You know what, I got the Kevlar plates, and they, they were worth, like, what, 3500 I'm up. Plus, I spent extra on ammo. 
Where is this stash location? He gave me stash coordinates. It specifically told me that he gave me stash coordinates. Huh. I don't see any. That's weird. I feel lied to now. Slightly. Huh. So these are my two options and neither one are very pretty. Great. Very unpretty things are about to happen. And looking at the time, I'd say these unpretty things are going to happen next time. I'm going to call that good for now, and I'll see you guys next time. Have a good day.